of freedom is now on display at the Milwaukee County War Memorial Center. But what makes it one of a kind is that it's made entirely by students. New at 5, Angelica Duria has the story behind this work of art. This is Up close, it's just a bunch of beads, pearls, blocks, and buttons. But from afar, it creates a moving mosaic for Iraq War veteran Colonel Kenneth Lee. When I come close, it looked like a chaotic thing. You know, it reminds me of when I was in Iraq. But when you take a step back, you know, it has a significant meaning. Called the Freedom Mural, the entire project was designed and made by fifth grade students over the summer through the program Sharp Literacy. Each little image, from an eagle to a rocket ship, illustrates their knowledge of the Revolutionary War and what it means to be free. We challenged our children what is freedom, and most importantly, to write about why they feel living in a free country is very important. Dreams for the American dreams. Some people come over here to have dreams like from Mexico, from other places to help us, to help themselves and family. On Thursday, the more than 200 participating kids got to see their completed work of art. It's wonderful. I think it was cool and it was bright and colorful. And share it with veterans at a special event. I don't even know what to say. It's, it's kind of amazing. We wanted children to connect from 200 years ago to today. To these kids, it's a simple gesture of showing their gratitude to those who served. Thank you for helping us for this freedom. And for others, it's a patriotic message that'll have a lasting effect. At the War Memorial, Angelica Duria, Fox 6 News. The fifth graders who created the mural were from Dorfler, Forest Home, St. Martini, and Trowbridge schools. Sharp Literacy has 12 other community mur uh, murals made by kids throughout the Milwaukee area. Some locations include the Intermodal Station, Discovery World, and General Mitchell International Air